right, so we had our fairy, or not our fairy, our veterinarian here earlier this week to take farrier view x-rays um, of our horses, and we got some interesting information back. It's something that I do annually, um, and as usual, I am the queen of short toes, but my toes on the horses still aren't short enough, so we're going to walk you through, we've done a video in the past about backing the heel or brightening the heel, um, and we're going to talk today about shortening the toes. This is a photo of her toes before our x-rays. To ensure accuracy, ask your vet to use barium on x-rays. So I'm just going to kind of talk through this as I go um, with you guys. This mare was trimmed about two weeks ago, but it is spring and they are shedding their soles a little bit. So um, I'm just going to take her back down to sole height on her toes. I'm working on her toe quarters, the toe, toe quarter. Um, so I'm going to take that back down level and then I'm going to start to do what we call a bevel once her walls are the level of her sole. Okay, so now I'm gonna work into what's called the bevel where I am going to bevel through um, the pigmented and unpigmented hoof wall. So I have my rasp at like a really, um, I don't even know, almost a 90 degree angle, I guess, to this foot. Some people call this a Mustang roll, I call it a bevel, but we're going right up to the white line, taking that toe back pretty aggressively. It's probably the most aggressive I'm ever going to have been, So, but x-rays don't lie, and if my toes are still too short, I don't want... Um, this mare has some uh, clicking in her suspensory branches, so we don't want to strain them any more than we have to. So I'm going to get, get brave and take these toes back. Alright, so now we're going to do just a little bit of work from the top. going by feel like there's just a ridge around where um, I'm meeting where I have beveled from the bottom so I can just kind of feel it better than I can explain it with practice you can too sometimes I just used to clean up my work with a little bit of a perimeter ass just to see where I'm at And now that I'm happy with the majority of her trim, I'm going to go through again with our owner approved radial rasp from Evo Evolutionary Hoof Care um, that we do carry here. And if you guys were to use this tool every week on the toe and the toe quarters of your horses, you're going to maintain your horse's short toes, expand your trim cycles with your farrier if you want to, if you can't have them back every two to three weeks like we recommend. And it's going to leave a nice clean bevel on your horse's toes. Here's the after view and just of note I've only addressed her toes on this trim. Not only does our vet use barium but she also goes back and takes all of the measurements and provides them to us in our records. Our radial rasp makes hoof care for horse owners an achievable task.